I can't see over my bag. But you, you fold your clothes flat? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I don't, I, like, I, don't like, I don't like the roll up technique. I feel like much. it wrinkles my clothes yeah, more. So it really, really does. Yeah. Oh, I feel like it doesn't wrinkle my clothes more. So it depends on my and, and here's the other thing. When, you, when it's flat, you, so you have to rifle through everything, but when it's rolled up, they're all side by side, that. and you can see all It's more user features. friendly. Yeah. 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 But I don't know how to get over the wrinkles. The time I'm rolling, I'm like, that. just back <laughs> <laughs> You just smash it all in there. Today is day two here in Tallinn, and today we're going to be covering a topic that you guys have been asking us to cover for a very long time. Today we're covering packing, but we're not doing it alone. We are joined by four of our new friends, the first two being Ashley and Josh from The Way Away. Welcome to The Water. Thank you. <laughs> and Eric and Allison from Endless Adventure. Welcome, guys. <laughs> so we have never done this before, but today we are hanging out with these two other vlogging couples who are just like us, which is crazy. <laughs> but different. We've all been traveling full time for over a year, and it's been so much fun hanging out with people yeah. in other countries. We don't do this often. Not at all. So today we've split our day into three separate videos. So we've already had some fun this morning on the Endless Adventure YouTube channel. So if you want to see part one of today. Go to their channel right now, then watch this video. We ate some weird yeah. stuff. <laughs> yeah, we did there. I, I, I bit the head off of a Small little fish. child. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. If that, you want to know what that means, see how that goes in real life. Go watch watch it. Part two. <laughs> and then, so this is part two right now, the packing part, and then after this, part three is going to be over all in the way. Right and you're going to, again, you have to watch our channel to find out what we do tonight. And it's going to be Something really, we've never done really before. Exciting. Yeah, so we're, we're really, really So many firsts for you guys yeah. recently. Yeah. <laughs> Who knows? What do we do when we just travel by Seriously? <laughs> okay, into packing. So we, we thought what would be fun to do, since all of us travel full time, we all live out of our suitcases, we thought we would share a few of our favorite packing tips, or like what we thought were the most useful mm -hmm. packing tips, and we're going to try and stay away from like the really obvious ones. So we've all picked a few things that we want to share with you today. But first, let us show you what our lives are packed into. <laughs> so this is a what life. we all live out of. We all live in basically a carry-on size suitcase. So we have to be very particular about what we pack. Everything is very useful. Yeah. Or maybe not. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, let's we'll start with tips. How did the bags actually print? We throw them. Everyone throws it at the camera. <laughs> Alright, Ashley and Josh, you can start us out. So again, our channel is The Way Way. This is Ashley, I'm Josh. And we've been traveling just like them, uh, except they're doing it way better than us. <laughs> and, and, this, and these are a, a few of the things that we find super useful while I travel. I, I'm a bit of a, a tech guy, so this is something I can recommend. It's called an inverter. This makes it so that you can use pretty much any piece of equipment, electronic equipment that you have around the world. So you don't blow up your host blow dryer. Exactly. <laughs> Oopsie. Perfect. And then you you just, like it comes up. with an little adapter, right? So you can plug it in anywhere in the world. But the cool thing is, is it comes with three plugins and four USB ports. Yeah. So it's your hub. You can plug everything into it. You don't need a giant wall wart that sticks onto the wall and mm -hmm. takes up three spaces. Mm -hmm. One plug three outlets plus USB. I love this. This for me is awesome. I got this at Uniqlo. It's a down jacket and it's so easily packable. Just this, this little thing and it kind of puffs up while you, when you take it out. Do you guys have down jackets as well? No, but I'm very no. jealous. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, exactly that. That's so classy. Well, packing, like living out of a carry-on bag is hard enough and then mix in changing from cold to hot seasons and it gets really yeah. tough. Yeah. Yeah. We have a similar jacket. We got rid of our neck pillows this year. So on airplanes, I've been using mine as hey. a neck pillow oh. whenever we're trying to Dual sleep. purpose. One other thing that we really love is um, a dirty laundry bag. It sounds simple, but this one especially is really cool. It's from a company called Tom Bin. Uh, we also, that's the luggage that we have as well. It's got a dirty side and... Which has a red string. Yeah, and then a clean side. So when you're when you're doing your laundry, you just stuff all your dirty stuff in this side, and then after you do your laundry, and you're coming back from the laundromat or whatever it is, you throw it all in the clean side, Brilliant. and you don't feel like you're cool. mixing stuff. So if you're a little bit of a germ freak, this is awesome. We also carry a splitter because we like to watch movies together. Or podcasts. Or podcasts when we're on... Buses or trains. Well, if anybody yeah. else likes Rick Steves, like the, like the walking tours, yeah. if you've yeah. ever tried yeah. sharing an earphone and walking oh, side by side, yeah. it's really Super tough. Annoying. Actually, Rick Steves is from our hometown. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, we should do a collaboration 
Rick Steves. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This video. And then another thing that I was thinking is so important are the extra batteries for your phones. Yeah. Oh, you just run out of batteries yeah. so easily call. and quickly. That's a good segue into uh, Kara's first thing. Ah. Which is... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so my bag is my tip. We just got these this summer. And you can charge your phone in the USB that's on the back. No, 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 this, this is, is actually that's a the lock. The, the future is here. The future is now. <laughs> oh, yeah. So you just open up this little guy, and there's two USBs right here. Do you ever feel like so you're really just nice. tethered to your bag, like you can't leave your bag now because it's got your charging and everything in it? No, I mean, I only use it when we're like transiting, yeah. okay. you know, and I'm using my maps and my phone. That's when your battery's gonna be like, drained. I'm yeah. gonna have my bag with me when we're sure. If you're at the airport and you're not in a lounge and there's like seven people all sitting, sitting on the ground trying yeah. to plug in, it's really nice. Just yeah. Be there's something awesome. so funny about just charging your bag. Yeah. <laughs> charging I mean, your you bag. Charge the bag? Cool. <laughs> my bag's oh. battery is low. This one is super simple and quick, but if you ever stay at a hotel that gives you a free shower cap, we use them as shoe covers because like a lot of times your shoes get nasty and then in our small bags our shoes are touching everything else. Yeah, so just throw the shower cap over your shoe and it keeps your shoe from getting the rest of your bag disgusting. That's so smart. Oh, I, that's that's my shoes just too. get everything dirty in my bag. Oh, I'm going to use that now. Is, yeah. And every time I'm just like, there's got to be a better way. Yeah. <laughs> I'll figure it out. <laughs> also, talking about the shoe thing. We found shoes with collapsible heels, mm -hmm. like yeah. they can get flat. We had Nike yeah. Freeze before this, and now we have the Allbird shoes. Both of them have collapsible heels, and that saves so much space. Yeah. Yeah. One of my favorite travel hacks that I discovered this summer, I love jewelry, so this is my jewelry bag, and I love necklaces, but I hate traveling with necklaces because they always get tangled, and mm -hmm. it drives me nuts. So... What is this? I got these little... They're supposed to be for cords like technology oh, it's yeah. just a strip of velcro oh. that is very ah. and i take my necklaces nice. i normally kind of like this oh. <laughs> i wrap my necklaces around each one so i have like five of course it's and it never, <laughs> and it never gets tangled never, <laughs> never ever <laughs> so you wrap it around and it's not tangled and then they don't get tangled with each other either yeah. and i've saved so many hours of my mm -hmm. life that's amazing untangling not untangling <laughs> not on my necklaces i'm gonna and use that just, for all my necklaces <laughs> you just roll it up and they all go in the same zipper. That is pretty cool though. Or you could use it for cords. Right so this is a like do it at your own risk tip. Um, it's a huge space saver. Maybe not technically legal. I think you're supposed to have your like prescription medicines or really any medicine in like a labeled canister. Yeah. But so I just got one of these like uh, Sunday through Saturday pill things that a lot of people you're like an old person. I'll, I'll listen. Yeah. I'll listen. <laughs> I don't want to offend anybody. I'll say it for you. Thank you. Uh, you so, say that we're 30 and old. And so, <laughs> we're old now. Yeah. I just write what each pill is on the top, and then I stuff the pills in oh. each day. So you don't to... accidentally drug her or anybody else. Yeah. <laughs> and so instead of carrying eight round circular yeah. like, pill bottles, this is that's one how, small, so that's small. how we carry it. Yeah. So before we left to travel full time, I didn't wash my hair often, and I still don't, but I used dry shampoo, and my favorite kind of dry shampoo was in an aerosol can. And we carry on a lot, and you can't travel with aerosol yeah. cans. Yeah. So before we left to travel full time, I was, it was probably what I was most nervous <laughs> about, was how am I going to have to wash my hair every day, I can't use dry shampoo, and then somebody bought me powdered dry shampoo. I've heard baby powder works exactly the same. So this is <laughs> it's a more a baby. expensive It smells really powder. good and you just squirt a little bit in your hair. Mm -hmm. I like to do it the night before and you wake up and it's just kind of soaked up all the oil. I wish so, so it That's I you, can't travel but with that. I love it. Yeah. Yeah. You so, could just take a shower. I think, <laughs> yeah, I think, well, there's that. That'd be too easy. Okay, one other thing that I'm not going to spend much time on because we said we wouldn't do obvious things, but just in case, I think we all travel we with use, yep, yep. packing yeah, cubes. I love them. So it's just like cubes that separate your clothing and keep it organized so yeah. when you want to get like one shirt out of your bag you don't have to like wrinkle everything else up so pants go in here underwear in here and then i've got another one 
So, once again, we are Eric and Allison from The Endless Adventure. We've actually all been traveling full time for about the same amount of time. Oh, yeah, right? almost yeah, exactly. But it's interesting to see like the different types of things that people, the different problems that you guys have sorted yeah. with your little hacks and things. Yeah. You know, It's very interesting because ours are a little bit different. The first thing that I wanted to say, and this oh, is uh, for both of us, these, <laughs> and if, if you guys have ever seen anything on our channel, any of our packing guides, we always talk about these. All the time. These are toothbrush holders mm -hmm. and they actually stick to the mirror. So the minute that we uh, unload all our stuff in a place, we take our stuff in the bathroom, we go stick it on the mirror. I have to have that. Yeah, have but it. they're so cool because like, well, it's Is not it for cleanliness there. or? Yeah, so yeah, it, it keeps it clean, clean while you're in your bag, but then it's easily accessible and you don't have to set it on like any nasty yeah. counter. Yeah, okay. So it just pops in and out into my little pen. You yeah, yeah, I'm that. so jealous. Yeah. I've got this ugly one. No. Yeah. <laughs> He's got this cute little pen. Yeah. The, the penguin's pretty cool. I would forget. Yeah, I would the, forget oh, that on the mirror. That's the only problem is you've got to remember. I've left it twice now. Remember to yeah. them So yeah. it's not good for the absent-minded like me, yeah. but yeah. if you I'm don't lose those. Yeah. So next up is another thing that both of us use. These are little cell phone wallet thingies that you stick to the back of your phone. So we just put a phone case on the phone and then stick these to the phone case, and they actually hold all your credit cards. Now, there's a bunch of these on the market, and we've tried some of the other ones, but these ones are very, very special. They have this little flap on the top that holds your cards in there. And not all of them have this. And yeah. guess what happens? They just your cards yeah. go, I'm yeah. literally running through the airport and I went like this and all my cards went It went, out. somehow there's a went, little nook in the wall and it went down to the floor oh, below us. We had to go all the way back down. I don't down think I found it. whatever card oh, I no. And I was going through it, I'm like, I don't even know what I lost. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Probably but something cool. important. But See? if you're nervous about losing everything, in your life that's valuable all at once, maybe don't do it. But for us, it's, it's been so you don't good. carry wallets at all. No, no just no, that. Just what about cash? Um, I would. I'll stuff cash in here, but she carries it all. Yeah. Okay, like pockets. I, yeah, I have okay. it in my jacket pocket. Because yeah. uh, my fear with a wallet, I've traveled with a wallet before, but I'll lose it. Yeah. Really, this yeah. is just I, I won't lose my phone. All right, so I guess I have some little like bathroom tips, not really hacks, but. Uh, I'm very pale and the sun doesn't like me very much so I do a moisturizer with built-in sunscreen and that way I don't have to have two separate things and I can use this kind of all over if I need to um, in a pinch so that I don't have to have a huge sunscreen thing. Yeah. So it's really nice thing. and it's, yeah. I use this stuff too. It's good. Yeah, it's awesome. It's, it's really lightweight <laughs> and then you don't smell like a sunscreen up tourist yeah. um, and you're getting moisturized. But then also this has been my favorite thing besides the dry shampoo. It's, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, micellar, micellar, micellar water, I don't know, apparently it's really fancy in France, it's this, <laughs> um, it's this like all-in-one face cleanser and uh. makeup remover, so I don't have to wash my face anymore, What? I just, you just put some of this on um, a little cotton ball or cotton swab, wipe your face, you're good to go. Huh. But it's your makeup right off. It takes all, waterproof makeup. Is it like witch hazel? Um, I don't exactly know. It was a little bubblier than witch hazel. Yeah. yeah. It's so good, especially on long travel days when I just feel disgusting. You just yeah. wipe your face and you feel good to go. And then I think our final one is um, these little ginger candy chews. Ashley actually turned us on to these. Mm -hmm. I get super car sick and I used to carry around Dramamine but it made me so sleepy. Mm -hmm. So we invested in these and it's literally just like ginger candies. But huh. if you chew them when you're traveling, it has worked wonders. I've yeah. gone on boats right. and buses and haven't gotten sick oh. since I've gotten these. We have some things to buy. This <laughs> right? is you know. super fun <laughs> hanging out with like other people that are living such a similar yeah. life to us. And it's crazy how many things I feel like we've learned from each other just by hanging out in the past 24 hours. Like you kind of feel like you're an expert and whatever you're doing, because you yeah. do it every day, but then you hang out with people who are doing the same thing, and yeah. they're doing There's it so in more. a totally different way, yeah. and in some cases, like a lot more efficient or a lot better way. So hopefully you guys found that helpful. Uh, we, we've we learned a ton yeah. in this video, so, <laughs> yeah. so hopefully for, for sure. other people who are like considering traveling long term, that this video is very helpful. So before we end this vlog, Josh pointed out that we're all probably carrying something that we don't use as much as we should. Mm -hmm. So we've all chosen one thing that we've carried around the world with us for a year and a half yeah. and don't ever use it. <laughs> but for some reason we keep carrying it. So mine is a uh, jump rope that we, <laughs> that I think I was peer pressured to buy by Josh in Mexico. But I have not used it one time and I'm still carrying it. Does anyone exercise? I, I do. She does. She oh, exercises like every day. Yeah. I do one, yoga like once every three days. Yeah. One of six. We yeah. walk. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We walk. That's true. We all walk. Yeah, yeah, we walk a lot. <laughs> For me, I've got a couple things that I carry around. I, I'm, I'm a weirdo. I've accepted yeah. it. 
Um, so when we were in Cuba, I bought some cigars. <laughs> they are long since passed, and I am still carrying around my humidor. That is I'm carrying a humidor around the world, and it is. It looks like a transit. Wait, 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 wait. This is his bag, and this is the humidor. That's like half of the bag. <laughs> and then another thing. Again, I'm a weirdo. I have a fountain pen collection, oh my God. and I love the idea of writing and sharing stories and stuff. Um, but I, j I make videos every day, and I don't have time to write, so I have four fountain pens. <laughs> Three things of ink and, oh, and an empty the, notepad. Yeah, and an empty notepad, and these are all full. <laughs> and somehow he still lives out of this bag. I think a slow clap is in order. Yeah. For, for <laughs> the, award, the, award, the award for carrying around the most useless stuff. Yeah. <laughs> a true Renaissance man. <laughs> so I have two things that I've never used. One, I have an eye mask that I saved from an airplane that was probably mm -hmm. like early, no, it is Japan Airlines. So that was- Our first country. Yeah, that was January of 2016 when we started traveling Whoa, and nice. I don't think I've used it since, so but I always think like, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna need an eye mask at some point and then yeah. I just never do. And then ever since Kara threw up on a <laughs> bus ride in the Philippines and we had no way, like she threw up in the trash can by the driver and then we put it back and they never knew the difference and it didn't have a trash bag in it. I've been carrying this bag as a potential barf oh, bag, like they give you on an airplane. Yeah. Because oh when you ride God. enough That's buses so and like boats and planes and stuff, huh. it's just good to have one just yeah. in case. Yeah, you don't want to use I have one too. So my item is a curling iron. I think I've used it twice. Because I thought I was going to have all this time, like, oh, I don't have to get to work every day. I'm going to do my hair every day yeah. with my dry shampoo. Mm -hmm. Do you feel safer, though, having it? Just yeah, it's like one day. I'm as a weapon? Yeah. 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 <laughs> all right. So I guess mine is an inflatable neck pillow, which I have used twice now, actually. This is the nice. neck pillow. You, you blow it up. It's big. Substantial. It's really big. You literally strap this on like a guitar. <laughs> And you can strap it to what? one to the chair and one to yourself down Whoa. here. So you can like I have like a whole body. Like when she says that, that to you for free or it, did you uh -uh. purchase that? I, I purchased that. this. Full wow. price. I did a lot of research and thought this was going to be like having a, a bed in your... It sounds yeah, like a good idea, know. but I can see her squirming when she uses it on a plane. She's like, this is a little weird. Yeah, everybody's like taking pictures of me when you're yeah. sleeping. And when I'm like trying to blow it up and yeah. it's getting bigger and bigger, I don't know. And you could just get winded and pass out. Yeah. Well, for my item, it's uh, very similar to Ashley's item. This is yeah. uh, an awesome workout band. And when I put this in my bag before we started this trip, I was like, yeah, I'm going to use this every day. I'm going to work out. Up. Yeah. <laughs> but I've never pumped any iron. I mean, I, I might have used it once. But she actually uses it all yeah, the time. Yeah, so I'm secretly happy he brought it along. Yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm the one carrying it. it though, so it's just kind of dead weight for me. So that wraps up the video. Again, we're going to link both of their channels down below and maybe in some card things up top if we get really, um, yeah, if we get really fancy. <laughs> we'll, we'll link them in some cards above. Um, but don't forget, if you want to see us eat some Estonian stuff, go to the Endless Adventures channel. Mm -hmm. And one. if you want to see what's happening next, that they're keeping a secret, a fun adventure, head over to the Wayways channel. Good job. Break. Good work. Good night, adventurers. We'll see you. <laughs> we'll see you on the road. We'll see your mom. That was road. fun. Yeah. We did it. So it's so really gonna be really. Hey, Ashley and Josh from the Wayway. And then we go. And then we go. One, two, three. Wait, do I not make noise? I should make the noise. <laughs> no, you can't. <laughs> Eric and Allison from Endless Adventure. Just saw the camera. I don't know if that really works, but... <laughs> sure. I think it'll be good. I think it'll make it work, yeah.